Hi, this is Nick Garner for Sports Talk for Kids, and I'm here with the Tampa Bay Rays pitcher David Price. During last season when you guys made that historic comeback, how much did it bother you that you weren't able to come out and pitch every night and only were able to do it once every four or five games? Uh, well, that's part of the problem with being a, a starting pitcher in baseball. You know, you only get to play really once a week, twice a week when you're lucky. So uh, it's something you kind of have to find stuff for yourself to do during the games, kind of keep yourself, I guess, entertained a little bit. But um, I guess I hear enough from these position players about how much their body hurts day in and day out. So I'm, I'm very thankful to be a pitcher and I enjoy my days off. What do you do during your days off? Uh, I mean, those are the days we really put in the most work. You know, after um, you know, day after I pitch is the longest run, and then like today is my second day, so I'll throw a bullpen. And I'm about to go work out and do that stuff. So um, I've got a lot of stuff to do in between starts, and then the day that I pitch is more or less uh, the fun day for me. How do you try and still affect the team positively while you're not pitching? Uh, being the best cheerleader I can, just making sure the guys are up, making sure everybody's trying to have fun and, and just cheer on my teammates. You know, I feel like that's a starting pitcher's job to do is kind of keep that dugout, you know, into the game, entertained and stuff like that. And that's what we try and do. Can you take us through your historic comeback of last season? Uh, well, it started with me giving up, I think, seven runs to the first four or five innings. And then uh, I mean, we made a great comeback there in the in the eighth and the ninth inning. And then Longo hitting that walk off for us, you know, him being him being Evan. You know, that's just uh, that's what he does. He's done it many times for us, and he's able to come through in the spot we needed him to. How much has it hurt your team this season with Evan having so many injury problems? Uh, I mean, it's definitely hurt. You know, he is the catalyst of our team. You know, he's a leader for us. He's uh, He plays the hot corner and hits in the three hole. So that's um, whenever you lose somebody that's as valuable as he is, a guy that's won, you know, gold gloves and rookie of the years and all the accolades that he's won. You know, whenever he's out for the extent that he's been out this year, it definitely hurts. When you're the ace of the staff, you're often going up against the ace of the other team's staff. How does how does that make you rise to the challenge as often as you can? Oh, well, I try and take the same mindset and the same approach into every game, but whenever you're facing somebody else's ace, you know, you have to you have to step up. You can't go out there and go five and six innings and give up two and three runs. You have to go out there and, and try and go seven, eight, or nine and give up just one or two. David Price currently leads the American League in wins and for the third time got voted on to the All-Star team. Fan favorite David Price took time out of his workout to sign autographs. That's great, thank you for your time and good luck. Thanks. Thank you. This is Nick Garner for Sports Talk for Kids. Hey kids, let's talk sports. Good job, man. Thank you very much. Good job. I enjoyed that. Thank you.